What's up guys, this video has been like a couple years in the making. I have been long overdue for a new bike, so I'm not gonna wait any longer. I can't wait to just crack this thing open and take a look at it. Unfortunately, I will not be able to ride it immediately just because it is it's still very cold outside. And there's snow on the ground. wheels here nice race face wheels so before it's completely given away. Why don't you go on down into the comment section, maybe guess what you think it is. No, this is not your bike. No. Very nice WTB Silverado saddle. Maxxis Minion DHR tires. float performance fork, or not fork, mid suspension. Cane Creek headset. Very nice. Here, Let's take a look at the fork. Very nice race face aluminum handlebars. Alright. Full carbon frame. Internal cable routing. In very good condition. 
we're gonna cut it right. Okay, so we cleaned up all the extra, extra stuff, and I also grabbed some tools just to get the handlebars mounted on and all that fun stuff. Excuse me. Thank you. Got a very nice King Creek headset. A lot shorter than uh, the headset on my Trek. I think this is a 40 millimeter, whereas mine is like 100 mil. So probably gonna take some getting used to. The handlebars are, handlebars are also a little bit wider. Um, Santa Cruz comes stock with I want to say 760 mil bars, which I think right now mine are, I want to say 680 on the Marlin. Yeah, shock yourself. You're gonna keep shocking yourself? Mm -hmm. So while I'm doing this, let's talk about this bike. This is a 2019 Santa Cruz High Tower uh, CS, so carbon frame S build, and that is not quite their top build. Um, they have the the XX1 and the X01 right above it, which come with the uh, XX1 and X01 drivetrains respectively. But I got this one because it was a rental. And they had finished renting it out. And so this is normally like a $4,900 bike and we got it for just about $3,200 on sale for Black Friday. And if you're wondering where I got it from, I got it from Eric's Bike Shop. And I've had the pleasure of talking with some of the guys there at Eric's before I decided to pull the trigger on this. And they made the buying process extremely easy. Um, they let me try out one of the non-rental high towers, you know, get a feel for it, make sure that, you know, when I got it, you know, I wasn't going to... To be disappointed or you know to feel like i didn't get what i was paying for which you know i really appreciate you know buying a new bike especially your first full suspension your first carbon bike it's always uh a little bit of an anxiety inducing process Excuse me, this is my first time experimenting with a through axle. My Shrek only has a quick release. So let's see if I can do this first try without embarrassing myself. Comment section is gonna love this. All right, you know what? We'll take a look at it later. But for right now, I got everything together. The bike shall stand. The dropper post works. I'll have to definitely get it set up for my height. But let's go ahead. Stand it up. Like this. Okay, now comes the next fun part, and that is crank protectors and pedals, because without pedals, we aren't going anywhere. Santa Cruz went ahead and included these pedal spacers. 
have a washers to put in between the crank and the pedal. So we're going to go ahead and use those. And so for pedals, we went ahead and went with the race face Chesters. They had fairly good reviews. I mean, I've always been hearing good things. I have a friend who uses them. I think the only concern that I had about them was uh, durability and making sure that they were going to be long lasting. I try to avoid pedal strikes like every mountain biker, but you know, they happen on occasion. And voila, we have pedals. All right. And voila. Here is the 2019 Santa Cruz Hightower CS. I'll have to put some uh, some air in the tires, but uh, yeah, very nice. The guide brakes, SRAM drivetrain, SRAM grips, or Santa Cruz grips, the Palmdale grips. Very nice. All right, thank you guys for watching. Um, here, before too long, I'm going to hopefully start uploading more content. We're going to be hitting a bunch of new trails on this, so you're going to be seeing quite a lot of it. And that's it. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed.